Okay, I got a little bit of a drink. Let's see, what should we do here for the next like hour? Let me take a look. <laughs> I have. <laughs> we could go back to Vampire the Masquerade for a little bit. A comb stream. Did I complete Phantasmagoria? I did not complete Phantasmagoria. Though, I'm not sure I would like to. Uh, uh, alcohol. No, it's an orange juice. It's just an orange juice. Uh, let's see. Well, I guess I could do... I guess we, I, we, we, I could just play the Masquerade for a little bit. Might as well. I feel like there's a little more that I'd want to see there. If, if only I play it for like an hour. Team Fortress 2? I mean... Um, I feel like we got started with Vampire the Masquerade and we just... I, I like abandoned it after one stream. No, let's, let's do that. <clears throat> no, no comb stream. Not tonight. Let's change this. Vampire, the masquerade, bloodlines. Yeah, I just don't, t I don't know, t I don't really want to play TF2 right now. I'm just not like really into it at the moment. I don't know if I ever will be. Let me open it, hold on. Careful your ears, it might be loud. I hope it's not, it's not that bad. All right, now, let me just make it so it is correct. And did it work? It did. All right. Vampire the Masquerade. Let's play this for a little bit. The last thing I did, I, don't, I think I was like, I was, what, what the hell was I doing? Let's try to remember her. Look, let's go. I don't, I remember I had to save it somewhere else. Because it was not good. I think we're going to go to this one. Yeah, I, mean, I, I look, I, 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 everyone that's like, oh, what about TF2, TF2, TF2? The way that I see it is this, right? Like. When, when you play a game, or you do something for long enough, you know, I, I enjoyed my time in it. It's, I think it's one, of my, it's one of my favorite games ever made. That's absolute. It's absolutely one of the best games ever made. It's in my top five, for sure. But just because something's like one of your favorite games that's ever been made, like doesn't, like I, I Chrono Trigger is one of my favorite games ever made. But I kind of did it, I got over, I got over playing it, and, like, I don't play Chrono Trigger every day, you know what I mean? That doesn't mean that I don't respect it wholeheartedly. I have, like, nothing bad to say about that game. Well, maybe, maybe I might have something bad to say about how Valve handled that game in the recent last few years, but, you know, it's just the way it is. So where are we going is the question here now. And how do, what are the buttons? Because I already don't know them. I think it's L. Okay, so the Nox is being stalked by an Asian vampire. Now, what about downtown? Investigate the Elizabeth Dane. But before you do, he wants you to contact Nines Rodriguez at the bar called The Last Round. Now, let's go downtown. Come here, you. Is 
F. No, F is bite guy. I forgot. F is bite. Hop it's in. E. Ribbit, let's go. Downtown. But that doesn't mean I'm never gonna play TF2 ever again. I don't, I don't know. I can't tell you guys. Guys, in one year, I'm gonna want to play TF2 again. Sometimes you just get an urge to want to do it. Like, I've done it before. I've had, like, the urge to jump in and play for a couple hours. But I, I'm not... I don't want to, like... I also don't want to, like, hold, like, a string out. Or, like, a candle, uh, a candle, a carrot on a stick and be like, oh, I, I might play it someday, that's why. Like, no. I... I just, I just, at this point, I kind of just do whatever I think is fun at the time. Just a gun on the ground? Okay, well, somebody dropped a gun. Alright, where's the bar? Looking for a bar. Start the timer. <laughs> What's with people just dropping guns and knives? Hotel... I'm looking for the bar. What's, is this the bar? This looks like a bar. The last round, it is a bar. Let me in. This is my kind of bar. Uh, what's the quick save again? Quick save is F9 and F12. Okay, you got it. Quick save. Okay. I need to play the pinball machine first, because that's the most important thing. Who are you? So that chase you in here, Cammy? You are the damsel of distress, yes? I'm dang. Someone talking shit about me over in that ivory tower? Who said it, huh? I'll kick their ass. I am the hair Listen to this music. The only words spoken were in my head. Kicking them in the head would be more effective. Lunatic. I give you a piece of my mind, seeing as how you're just another do boy for the Camarilla. Shit. No amount of good sense penetrates that <laughs> white noise <laughs> in your <laughs> <nostalgic> <laughs> brain, does it? Something is plaguing you. What? Weird you say that, yeah. You might say something is plaguing me. A plague bearer, as a matter of fact. You just want my opinion on the new update because it's interesting. Well, that, um, it's, I'm just glad they're actually doing it. It took them a long time to get it out there, but the look, t Team Fortress 2 is is like fucking like ten years old. It is so old. I can't think of any other video game that is nearly like nearly a decade old, more than that. That is still being played and updated with by the developers that originally made it. A That's a long fucking time. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. We can't get sick, but the kind can. World of and Warcraft? But World, the, what a, but, but, but World of Warcraft is like a... Sick, you have to pay to play. Wow. We TF2 is not a subscription-based game. You, you just play it. It's a, it's a first-person shooter. It's a multiplayer first-person shooter. It's not a... They're not, it's not like a fucking subscription-based video game. Uh, shoot the pigeon away. May sound cruel, but it's necessary. If someone puts together two and two as to the real cause of an outbreak of bloodborne diseases, bloodborne. guess what happens? So the plague bearer's got to be found and put down. If the Camarilla really gives a damn, they'll help us out. Uh, my neck owes a debt to the Anarchs. What shall I do? One of our boy's ghouls, name's Paul, lives nearby in the Skyline Apartments. Been a stranger lately. Looked like death last time he was here. Said he didn't get there. Go find somebody in the apartment. Okay, I will. I will Wait, fuck that guy Paul's up. Not talking. You might want to start questioning the homeless pop. So many have been dying lately that it takes the city a few days to pick up the bodies. Okay, so go talk to homeless people. I will spread my mind around the city of angels. See you, damn, damn sale. So what about? Um, okay, so I still have to find Nines Rodriguez. When you, you guys Nines Rodriguez? You don't look like Nines Rodriguez. You go up the stairs. Nines Rodriguez? Is that you? 
What errand does the prince have you run today, boy? Ah, uh, the jester plays his little games and sends his little birds. Yes? What? What the hell did you say? You're Malkavian, right? Yes, I am. You doubly screwed. Crazy as hell and the prince is bitch. A little pawn, you say? Yeah, you got that one. The music is just overpowering. Greetings, Helter Skelter. I seek the name of the numbers. Man, I hate talking to you guys. Nines. Name with numbers. Nines Rodriguez, right? He's upstairs. More. But watch yourself. We don't take kindly to Camarilla spies around here. Okay. You're a two-headed dog on the shores of a poisoned sea. Farewell. Well, goodbye. They're going to go even more up the stairs. You showed up. Good. Here's what I got to tell you. Is it so him? So you know, I don't lecture, I don't rap, I'm no bureaucrat. I'm just a guy out of nowhere came to be involved was in upstairs. something 500 times bigger than you and me. More! You got a right to know the score. The Camarilla, this is the short of it. They operate a lot like a pyramid scheme. There's a bunch of these old timers at the top with God only knows what plots in mind. They lose their power, they die. They sired more to carry out their plans. Yeah, this guy does have like a much better face texture. He was schemes, animated so more. And on and on. It everybody else. Just thinking about the mess. And it works out to exist. Only a few people at the top have any real So what happens if I kill this guy? Can I? Uh, okay. LaCroix? Shit. LaCroix. LaCroix is just the guy who backstabbed and wheeled and dealed his way into becoming... Multi-level marketing. ...all the local Camarilla. Him and any of the traders that sided with the cam want power here, they'll get what's due. Okay, just get your... Just get your friends and family to sign up for this... Shake company. This natural... Energy drink. Them's fighting words, newbie. Yeah. I'm still up here. I'm still up So I won't make an example out of it. See, the Camarilla claims all of us are members, even if we don't want to be. Which is, of course, the biggest little horseshit a man ever heard. Uh huh. Uh, let me hear your truth. I learned buddy. the way of this world during the Depression. A bunch of old rich bastards screwed the country. But did they suffer? No. The little people suffered. You can't trust them. <laughs> Rob the Zombie. The world would be a better place without them. All you can do is get a group of people together who aren't assholes. Find a place to put your feet up and make some examples of the quote-unquote elite mm -hmm. to keep the rest the hell out. Oh, the elite. Everyone's an equal here. The same thing this country used to be about. He's That's talking about that. He's talking about the Washington the elites. The okay. Camarilla was kicked out on their ass a long time ago. We, the Anarchs, didn't want to play their politics anymore. Well, this guy's an Anarch. Now LaCroix hop in like they never left. Uh-uh. No goddamn way. Their laws don't apply to us. Right, so I, I, I'm going to join these guys. Meet with them baloney all around. You and the Prince don't golf on the weekends. LaCroix represents <laughs> everything I hate. The Camarilla, stuck-up aristocrats, rich businessmen, crooked politicians. The only place LaCroix belongs is in an urn. Oh, wow. Uh... I got their meeting right here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I, what did I, easy, 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 easy. I pressed one and he pulled out a gun. Are you the prince of thieves and are and are these your merry men? Isn't this where your theme music kicks in? Ha <laughs> stereotype. What the hell with you then? <laughs> oh, shit. Run back to your tower. Oh, whoops. Say what you want about me, but not one of us in this <laughs> bar is a no good two faced backstabbing would be tyrant like that son of a bitch, LaCroix. That's perfect. He and his Camarilla are on borrowed time. You tell him Nines Rodriguez said so. <laughs> Time can also be spent, and I have overpaid tonight. I am gone. He, he, he. <laughs> Perfect. Wait, did I miss? Did I fuck up the quest? Okay, I gotta go back and report to the prince. Thought I told you to get back to your tower. Run along. I think LaCroix's shoes need polishing. Now look what the street chased him. Uh oh, here he is. With Phil and Jake and lots of time and venture and fun of friends. Here he comes to say goodbye until the never ends. Where you headed now? Venture time. Okay, then why are you here then? Bye. <laughs> that, song, that song sucked, by the way. I like Adventure Time's cool, but like I fucking hate that song. What what are you trying to accomplish with that song? 
<laughs> it's not so. Now let's go back to the tower. Wait, I, I'm supposed to talk to the homeless people, right? I don't think this guy's homeless. No, I'm just kidding. It's funny. It's Pendle it's Pendleton Ward playing on a ukulele, and he's like the weird guy that made that show, and that's what it's like. It's self-referential, right? I don't know. I've only seen one half of one episode, and I was shit-faced. I thought it was Cat Dog when I first saw it. I have to like it checked in again. Yeah, you go right on up and see Mr. LaCroix. Oh. Uh, did you? Uh, cover me, Tubbs. Uh, well, uh, whew, must have dozed off for a minute. Okay. Why can I not go up? Oh, there we go. Adventure time. Give the Anarch community my regards. <laughs> Sorry about the sapphires. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, done. Blah, blah. Woof, woof. If I may give you a piece of advice, always listen to others' words carefully. Read between the lines. Gauge where you stand with them and who they decry or exalt. The more you know about someone, the greater your advantage. Now that that's out of the way... I trust your time to go to, to leave for the fight game. the Great Dane. First, I wish something from your head. I'm always ready to be already gone. Uh, yes. Okay. Good. I'm counting on an encore exposition of the talent you showed earlier. Go. And remember, under no circumstances are you to open the Ankaran sarcophagus. So we'll that means... Later. Good. I mean, I'm, There's a boat waiting for you on the beach in Santa Monica. I am going to open it. That's just how it works. Santa Monica. Go to the beach in Santa Monica where the boat will be waiting to take you to the ship. Let's do it. That's, that's the first chance I get. I'm I'm mashing E to open that. Look in the fridge. Going somewhere? Yes, I am. Back to Santa Monica. Never trust a Malkavian with sensitive bad. info. Yeah. Right, so I gotta get to the beach. Beach access. Ooh, don't swing a knife in public. That's something you don't want to do. You're gonna get in trouble. Well, I was doing melee, right? From what I remember. <clears throat> Fun will never end. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not allowed to kill anybody on this mission, really. Well, I have points in uh, Obfuscate, so I'll be okay. There's the boat. Let's get in. How does one get in boat? Like that. <laughs> you just jump in. Okay, quick save. So I can't kill anybody on the Dane. Why not? Am I... Oh, Pally, over here. So am I not allowed to be here? Not for Christ's sakes. Tell Jacobson if he plans on making editor-in-chief, he's got to start working with me. I, guess I can't I can... keep getting in these scoops if he's going to send high school journalists who don't know enough to wear something that would blend in. See in me a vision of Jacobson's corrupt crony. Take it easy, Flash. This is still a badge you're talking to. Didn't work? Where are our hands in this business? All right, look. I got you a copy of the initial report, and I can get you into the cabin, but you gotta make yourself real Jerry scared after that. 
anybody catches you, I don't know you. And no goddamn flash photography brain shit. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Hold up. This is a sec. stealth mission. Heinz to Marsh. Heinz to Marsh. Marsh, they need you up in the bridge. Over. He's speaking into his there. hand. The security room will be clear. Okay. Head down the stairs behind you and stay low. When you get down there, wait for me Kramer's to call Kramer's gonna up open up the back door. Hey, Jerry. As as he leaves, Weird. Get your ass moving and don't let him see you. Can't believe it. I'll give you a couple of minutes. I fell down the stairs. Really Let's go. In and out. A vampire okay? was in the hallway and I just scooped out of there. What's gonna happen? Don't forget to stay out of sight. If anyone sees you, you're on your own. Take the stairs up to the security room. There'll be a computer mm -hmm. in there. Mm -hmm. The password mm -hmm. is Lighthouse. Lighthouse. All one word. You getting all this? I get it. Now get a move on. And don't forget to tell Jacobson I get double my usual fee for this one. Double? F I think I remember. <laughs> double the fee, huh? Well. You sure? I'll give you double the fee. Double the delish. Heinz to Jacobson, uh, Anderson. Heinz to Anderson, come in, Anderson. Come check this out. I just saw a baleen whale. Doesn't seem to mind. All right, wasn't yeah. he supposed to get me somewhere? Is, is it... <laughs> I thought I thought the police were on my side here. Now he's shooting at me. What? I don't understand. Why? I just bit- he didn't even know! He didn't even know I bit him! Fine, I won't bite him. And I'll sneak. Heinz right, to I, Jacobson. Right, let's uh, sneak here. Anderson. Heinz to Anderson. Come in, Anderson. Oh, I can get you inside of there, but uh, Yeah? Yeah, I can get you inside of there. How do I turn this shit off again? N. Okay. Alright, we're sneaking. No, what is the actual I feel like I have to get a box and like grab it and look at it, right? Do I have enough lock picking? Uh below a difficulty of three. Can I just get in there? Uh, what have I got? I got dexterity. What about what? What increases my lock picking? Melee. No, wait, what? Security. Okay. I'm gonna put a point into security. I'm gonna put two points into security. Done deal. Let's get it open. Save it here. It's got a bigger skill tree than Path of Exile. Records room. Another. Locked pick. Below six. I could buff myself, but I'm gonna I'm gonna end up dying. Let's just do it. I'm gonna go crazy. Alright, what is this? Why is C? Why? Okay. This is a ship manifest. Ship manifest. Interesting. What else we got? Experience awarded one. Okay. Um. Ship manifest. Uh, Arca and site transport to Los Angeles. Arca and sarcophagus. Three crates, pottery tables, one box. Unidentified. Okay. You can use the blood bag. Shit. Alright, save it here. 
going to drink this guy. There are 30, there are 45 people here. The green circle lets you know how close to people you are. So this, there's like seven, there's like 78, there's 80 people, 90 people, 100 people. <laughs> I'm kidding. He heard me. That guy heard me do that. How would you hear me? What, what is with this? Come on. Come here, please. He doesn't know where that was. He didn't know where that came from. I can climb this, can I? Of course I can. All right, I can, I can, I can, I can, uh, I can OB here. I'm gonna OB up here, I think. Can I keep going? Okay, I just like alt tab the game somehow. What the hell happened? What? But what wow, the fucking Windows key? I swear to God. Dude, will will there ever be a use for the Windows key? They're like having a no oh, Jesus fucking stealth mission. Oh god, damn it! There's so many people here. Ay ay ay! Grab the grab the manifesto. Did I get it? Can the officer over there see me? What the fuck, man? What? Why? What? <laughs> what is the point of- Oh my god. He can see me, yeah. I, I, he can see the guy behind him. I just I pressed F so he turned around and shot me. Save it here. I can just remove it. I really should just pull it off. I don't even know if I picked that up. Okay, let's try this again. Fucking God. If I'm close enough for an execute, I'm apparently not close enough to bite him. <sighs> I'm close enough to get an execute prompt, but not close enough to bite the fucking guy. Jesus Christ. Get out of the way. Moon Gamer. No, I got an execute prompt. That means you're close enough to, like, do some damage. Don't fucking do that. What? F5. No, F5 is not the right key. Can't imagine how the hell I would do something like this without <laughs> without obfuscate. I got one EXP. I explored the crime scene. Quest log has been updated. I better get to a spot where I'm not gonna get seen. Oh no, no, no. It's alright, just keep it up. Is that the that's the sarcophagus right there? Let's just open it. You have successfully completed your task aboard the Elizabeth Dane. Report back to the prince. Let's, 
We're gonna open the box, right? What happens if I do this? Can I not open it? I don't think I can open the box. Alright, box can't be opened. <laughs> Good to know. I completed the mission. So now I just gotta get out of here. I have to like go all the way back? Oh yeah, yeah. Did that guy smell me? Oh shit. I'm just gonna have to reload it again. What a, what a waste of blood that was. I could have just went this way. It's permanently invisible. <laughs> this is such, this is such cheating. I feel like I'm playing Metal Gear Solid. Remember in Metal Gear Solid 1 and 2, you'd just be permanently invisible walking around. That's so funny. Remember, you could, it, was, it, was, it was a bandana? Or the stealth suit. And why would you ever want the bandana? The bandana was useless. It gave you infinite ammo. Oh, well, that's that's cool when you can permanently walk through the whole game and not be seen once. I'm, okay, I'm gonna fuck this up. Just wanna make sure you guys are aware of this. I'm going to screw this up. No? I'm good. <laughs> All right. Victory. Get out of the way! And this should take us back here. What happened? What ha What is going on? Is there a guy out there that shot me? Okay, well, whatever. I'm gonna blame this on how fucking sloppy the doors are in this game. I want to like open a door and it's like, <laughs> like back and forth, back and forth, yeah. Well, that door can't even be opened. Where the hell am I going? Take this. What is, what is this? What am I taking? Oh. That was a loud, that was a loud sound. Oh, God. It's just, just fucking open. For Christ's sake. Okay, there's a guy down here. Save it here. I gotta go out this way. Bad guy right outside the door. Get it on that computer. Okay. Where was the computer? Okay, I thought there was a. I just freaked out. I thought there was a guy in here. I'm using all this blood for no reason, too. Okay, uh. Control. Hack it. Be why I don't have a good enough, don't have a good enough hacking skill. Okay, I'm gonna leave the boat. I, this mission was dumb. I hate this mission. This mission is stupid. Go sneak and walk up to a sarcophagus and then sneak out. No, not fun. The haunted house was awesome. The other mission, the the the, the split personality girl was awesome. This is dumb. Oh 
What? How would you even know what I was? What? Why are they investigating this? What? What? Why am I stuck? What? Why? What? Why? 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 God! I touched him! It was like six feet between me and the wall! Get out of the fucking way. Get out of the way. You tell me I bumped into this guy. Look at how much space there is. I could move a dresser draw through this. I could move a draw through here. I didn't kill him. I didn't kill him. I didn't kill him. Is that gonna be bad? You said don't kill anybody on this mission, but what if I don't kill him? Wait, isn't this the... This is my friend, right? I thought this is the guy that I was like working with. Is that why you can't kill anybody? Is that the reason why? The password's a lighthouse on the computer. What? But you guys are just... You guys are just giving me the answer. I would not have known that was the answer. You guys are all giving me the answer. How do you not understand this? Let me just type in the fucking free answer. The cop? No, he didn't. The cop didn't tell me shit. All right, I'm happy again. Uh, what else we got? Just driving this around. <laughs> All ball kids are open. All right, we're we're we're, we're, we're moving, and I, I get to I get to I get to go in the police car and press the button and sound the horn. All right, that was fun. It was my free experience. Uh, let's see what the weather's gonna be like. Not bad. Oh, uh, I don't have this password. I loved this game until this part. Like this is this was like I loved this game until this stupid fucking dumb stealth sneak shithole mission. Why what's going on here? And now I can't go anywhere. I can't sneak by this guy, apparently. If this touches him, I'm gonna fucking scream. I touched him. Of course it did. So, if I can't sneak by that guy, should I just go the other way? Where's my scream? <laughs> I'm gonna have to like make this guy go crazy or something. Uh, let's go with... Hysteria. <laughs> I still touched him, though. Okay, uh... Do something weird! What? Run away! He's not gonna move. I have, I have, it's like right there. Why do I have... Punch him and run away? I, I can't, can I? What if I give him, like, hallucinations? 
Okay, there. Maybe he'll run over there now. Does he? Does it? Does it matter? I guess it doesn't matter if you touch anyone. I get. I get to go around. I'm running out of blood. Fucking Jesus Christ. here just get me out of here please get in the fucking door all right now turn this off I don't, I don't even know where the fuck I'm even supposed to go to like feed on him, make him pollute. I fed on him, and he just started shooting me. I don't know. I don't think there's a guy behind here. Whether there might be. Where does this even lead? I have no idea. This is bad. Okay, this is this is the correct way. So now, where the hell am I supposed to go? Do I just talk to this guy again? Is this guy going to shoot me now? Or what? You waiting for your chauffeur to pull around the dinghy? <coughs> <laughs> Bless you. Like, do I have to jump off into that? Alright, let's let's get in there. Speed run. Oh boy, I, I fucking hated that. That was just like, it's just some stealth, like stealth dog shit. I hate that. Ah. Uh, especially considering I have to consider, I just did everything about that I, I despised. This game was a 10 out of 10 until I got to that part in the game. I have to go across the whole fucking town to go to the beach, to get on the boat, to stealth around like a sloppy asshole, to look at the sarcophagus, to turn around, walk away, go back on the boat, Go back in a fucking taxi. Go back to fucking downtown. What? That mission was stupid. That mission sucked. Asshole. Where's the fucking... Where's the... Where's the taxi? Yeah. Get me out of here. What is this? Is the taxi closed? I need blood too. Where's the humanity? Um, I think I have to go back through here. Also, chat lied to you. Stealth wasn't required for that mission. You just got a bonus. No. Oh. Well, good. Hopefully, stealth is never required ever. No, the mission wasn't hard. It was just. Boring and stupid. Where to? Are you saying that Twitch chat lied? Oh, God. Where's this fucking tower? Let me up there. Evening, Chief. You back to see Mr. LaCroix again? Yeah, he told... Wait, you told me to send you up as soon as you came in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am gone. Thank you. Mm, 
Okay. We lied for your own good. Where did I get the visor? I've said all I need to for now. It's the four horsemen of the apocalypse. Easy. <laughs> Easy, guys. Whoa. Whoops. I don't have time for a monologue. Give me the bullet points of what you saw. Now, the decks were washed with the blood of seamen. And the Ankaran sarcophagus. What did you see? There was blood on it, and it was, it was a very boring, awful shit mission that you made me go on. I now don't like you. I'm now going to try to do everything possible to go against you. Opened. Let's not jump to conclusions. Give me the manifest in your notes. I'll sort this mess later. You might have noticed when you came in the parade of malingering Molly Cottles filing out. Oh, yes. I wondered about them all this time. Huh? Sure. Those were the Primogen, this city's clan elders, a worrisome bunch devoted first and foremost to the security of their own skin, which is why they were here. <laughs> it seems Alistair Grout, a Malkavian Primogen, has either um, forgotten how to answer his phone is missing each minor problem like a grain of sand each night i inherit the desert the sabbat's appearance has put the primogen on edge grout's mansion is in the hollywood hills i need you to pry grout out of whatever crack he's crawled into and have him contact us uh send in the ghouls my blood is too valuable to waste if it pleases you um sure i guess yes. uh, about grout as i said I grout is the malkavian primogen his behavior and home are eccentric, to say the least. He's developed a paranoid bent lately, so you may have to check under every bed in the place for him. Okay. When we hear from Grout, you may come back. Until then. Okay, bye. So where do I go now? Uh... Contact this grout guy. Mansion on the outskirts of town. No, I don't. I don't. This, this sound, that sounds real fucking boring. Damsel sent you on the trail of the plague bearer, the kindred responsible for the outbreak of the L.A. epidemic. She has suggested going to speak with the ghoul Paul at the Skyline Apartments or talking to some of the bums around the city. What about back here? Hmm. Carnival of Death. You saw the murder scene on the pier, but weren't able to find anything specific about the killer, except that he was extremely brutal, vicious, and beast-like. I'll just do this one for now. Skyline Apartments. I, I guess I think I missed the opportunity to do the hospital side quest. So, well, I guess I could find a bum. Wherever they hang out. Or the apartments. Where are the Skyline apartments? Uh, we'll go this way. That's the hotel. You look kind of, you look like a bum, but you're not, you're not responsive. Get out of my way, man. I'm gonna, I gotta, I gotta eat somebody. I'm gonna get info and then I'm gonna eat the person. It's the last round. Huh? Right, here's a bump. What do you want? I need to know the disease that haunts the homeless. Yeah. Well, I'd feel a lot more like talking if you gave me a few bucks. You know, how about a twenty to lubricate the old vocal cords? Twenty bucks? Uh, how about I just go into your mind and tear it limb from limb? Okay. I mean, I don't know too much about nothing, but I know as a tin can Bill's been telling some crazy stories about how he's got sick and all. Something about a monster or some such. Where's the man of the cans? You can usually find him down in his alleyway, just across from that bar nearby. Okay. Wait, is he, is he talking about right here? Jesus, bring me a candle. It's Hanukkah. Get down here. Get away from my stuff. 
A uh, helpful homeless person has pointed out Tin Can Bill as a possible link in the Plague Bearer chain. He can be found in the alley across from the last round. Okay. So, like, down here. Or down this way. Down here. Mm, tin Can Bill? You know, you're definitely not Tin Can Bill, but I'm gonna just eat you anyways. You don't have any blood. I, I, I got just enough blood where I'm not going to have a problem. Tin Can Bill? You look like Tin Can Bill. <coughs> Who's there, huh? Old Bill can't see too good these days. Is, is that you, Fred? I ain't got no booze tonight. Where is so may as well get the hell out of here. <coughs> Dark brother. What are you talking about? It's just me, old Tin Can Bill. Now leave an old man alone to sleep in peace. I don't want to be bothered unless you've got a bottle to share. Those of you that were here for the Call of Cthulhu stream, yet again, we have uh, an old man or an old decrepit person that has just added air in their throat. There's a monster, you see. A monster with his face all twisted and ugly, teeth longer than your finger, and these eyes piss yellow and full of hate. I've never seen eyes like that before. Still giving me bad dreams. Uh, keep your tongue wagging. He grabbed me, threw me over his shoulder, took me to the His madness, voice changed. The dark place. <laughs> oh, God. The smell. Worse than anything I've... And then he bit me. My neck. Oh, God. It was horrible. Don't remember too much after that. Blacked out. Oh, well, where is he? up here in my alley. <laughs> Haven't been feeling Do the well voice for him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where did the bestial brother take you? <laughs> That's pretty good. Came up through the sewers, he did. That was not in the script. Around the corner there. <laughs> <laughs> Don't want to go back to the bad place, friend. <laughs> and now you're just overdoing it. Don't let the monster come back and take me there. <laughs> this is the this is like Jim Carrey in the mask when he's the cop is holding him and he's just coughing and he wins the award. Say with this last lonely liquor, drunks always die alone. What? What did I just do? What? What happened? Why did I just freak out? What uh, he's dead. Why did he die? I have no idea what just happened. But apparently, I did something wrong. I went into a frenzy and I killed him. Tin Can Bill has pointed you in the direction of the sewers near where he took his last breath as possible home of the Plague Bearer. So we've got to go in the sewers over here somewhere. So where is the sewer? Right here. I need blood so bad. Is there like a... Come on, where, where's like the... It was like the rich asshole that has like the best blood in the world because he gets it like pumped into him. Whatever. I have to eat some rats. I'm looking for a rat to eat. There's one right there. I'm going rat hunting. I'm just gonna eat rats until I'm satisfied. How long is that gonna take? <laughs> I get just like a teaspoon of blood. That's all right. All right, so I guess we're just going over here. Sewers near where he took his last breath is the possible home of the plague bearer. Um, this is like, I guess this is the only place I can go? There's nothing else really here. I guess this way. Looking for a plague bearer. Where's the plague bearer? He's hiding somewhere. Is it, I'm assuming it's just like a, a guy.
I don't know. I'm looking for the pallbearer. Plague bearer. These are the wrong sewers. Wasn't this the manhole that was right next to this guy? The wrong manhole. Wasn't this like literally like not even 15 yards away from that the hobo? It was the wrong one. There was one even closer. Well, I'm hearing fucking... What am I hearing here? There was another manhole. Well, I've ran in a circle and I don't even fucking remember where the hell I even came from. I have, I have no idea what's when I even came up from. No, I'm being baited again. So you, I am being baited. It's not real. Can I get in here? I don't know what to believe anymore. It's not even in this sewer. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna go up this one because I have no idea where I am and I will find the one next to the, the homeless guy. Okay. So, wait. Wait, 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 wait. This, uh, that was the right one. So where is this... There, there's his dead body. Where's the manhole? Are you guys... Right here? What the fuck? Oh my god. It's not... It wasn't a bait. It actually was down here. I came up through one and went to the other one that was five feet away. Alright, Mr. Plague Bearer. Where are you? Hanging out with the rats. <laughs> I think it's both gonna go to the same place. No, I'm gonna get grabbed. He's gonna be like over here and he's gonna jump up and bite my neck or something and I'm gonna be really, really annoyed. Yeah. Let me get more blood from rats than you do from like a human bump. I'm gonna fill my health bar. <laughs> Human bum. As opposed to another, like, bum. Alright, I think we're good. Guy here, hello. This looks pretty menacing. Uh, I think I found the thing I was supposed to find. This is def. This is definitely. If I was a plague bearer, this is where I would be. Absolutely. The smell of entrails and rotting flesh. Looking for a free meal. He's not lying, I was. There's meat galore in my kingdom. What is the business of the bestial brother? Ah, this place is dark and devilish as my soul. The doors have been opened, the seals broken, and the final steps into the abyss. The terrible mysteries of the ninth circle. Is this guy like four feet tall, or am I just this is the weird camera here for some reason? Uh, what is the business? What's your business? Brother Canker, they call me. High Lord in the diseased halls of the dead. Look around you. The blood. Yeah, this guy's made it of plastic. Somebody held a lighter to this guy's head. Shells. These are the signs. The coming of a new age. 
Ah, okay. The Brotherhood of the Ninth Circle. The darkest dawn is almost upon us. This is Robert Akendall. Medic. Join us in these last nights, spreading our disease upon the earth, sharing this unholy communion with our human heart. That's Robert Akendall. He's in every, he's everywhere. You can always tell when it's him. They are the weak, sick, hopeless. I bring them a new purpose. They are the vessels of darkness, carrying the diseased truth in their veins. So, did this guy die? Yeah, yes, truth. Might I join your putrid platoon? Come, join the disciples who have gathered here, floating in their own putrescence. I will show you the mysteries of our brotherhood as I feed on your flesh! <laughs> it seems we will not unite, Dark Brother. I will send your ashes to the Ninth Circle. Oh! Okay! Oh! Ow! Ow! Get away, get away, get away, get away! Ow! Get out of here! Press tab to block. Oh, well, whatever. Didn't even need it. Alright, so what, what do we got here? We got a lever. We open That opens something. It opens the gates. There's a lever here. And there's a lever on the... There's a wheel on the other side. I don't know what that does exactly. Not so, I'm not sure. What does that do? I can spin them both this way or both the other way? Yeah. I can't see what they're opening. I guess there's a block button. Well, this is like more of a stance. I guess those don't do anything. So, you've killed Brother Kanker. Brother Kanker, report back to Damsel. Gonna swim down there apparently. I can already hear it. You should have done the tutorial because I don't know how to swim. Okay, there we go. See, that was that was interesting. That was cool. I like that mission. This mission. The, this was cool. That was interesting. He was scary. He was weird. He made a lot of cool noises. We killed him. Got the exp for it. Now we go back. Holster. And here we go. Up we go. Back to the bar. Can I buy some proper clothes? The garden of Alfred. I can't even talk right now. Where did, where am I? What? What happened here? What? I thought that was going to bring me up. Where am I? What is going on right now? What happened? Uh, uh, I thought this was, I thought there was going to be a ladder going up. Okay. That's not the right way to go. Interestingly enough. Uh, maybe I'll try this one. I found it. Up we go. Hello. So now let's go back to downtown. Well, I think we are in downtown. Yes, we are. Well, excuse me, I will take your blood. You don't even have a rat amount of blood in your body. What a joke.
So what do we get for doing this? What are you gonna give me? Ugh, can't. The carrier pigeon is extinct. Right on. Except we just did a second one over near the convention center. Huh? They're part of some doomsday cult, apparently. No telling how many there are. I gotta kill another one. Season on all these sick sons of bitches. Okay. More pigeons for this cat to catch. What did you just say? Prince, okay. Damsel has informed me that there is more than one plague bearer in the city, and they all need to be destroyed. She had previously suggested going to speak with the ghoul Paul at Skyline Apartments. Okay. So, Jerma here. We have our two bites out of an ice cream bar. That's our faction. And I'm going to put another point. I have eight points. Strength? I'm going to say either strength or brawl. Dodge. Mm. I can't put one in melee. I don't know. Maybe I should just put it in strength. That's a mirror. Let's do strength. Just hit harder. Put one into firearms just because I have the points. Let's go kill the other one. Did does my hair ever get any better? Do I ever get like a new haircut? Can I sit at like the WoW barber? All right, we gotta get this. Like, we gotta get this fucking. No one's even gonna look. Well, the guys in the hazmat suits will. All right, so where are those apartments? Let's see. Skyline apartments are two. They are far away. So I gotta go like across the whole city here. Uh, so it looks like this is down here. I just gotta go all the way around. I get a silly hat in the next outfit. Sign me up. Did I see the WoW expansion reveal? Uh, I I didn't pay very much attention to it. It's like uh, orcs versus humans again, right? They're going back to the PvP-esque. They want to go back to having like horde versus alliance, right? Lovely evening. It is. Okay, so I'm here. Just keep going. Down this way. Let's make sure I'm going the right way here. Where are the six? So... Uh, okay. So I do have to go down here. I think I'm going the right way. <clears throat> I'm probably not going to get involved with it. I'm not going to play it, I don't think. Not anymore. Parking here. This is not the right way. I had my time with it. And I played the absolute hell out of it. Okay, just straight into the left. Save. What's that? A knife. Don't need it. Skyline Apartments. Confession. That doesn't look like apartments. Skyline Apartments. Here we go. Find the guy and murder him in his his hotel room. Because he's definitely a bad guy. Alright, we're looking for... Who are we looking for? P. Anderson? What was his name? Paul? Five? Pretty sure it was five. Did I pick four? I wanted... Not six. Which one did I press? I think I pressed the right one. Use uh, the vents. A long elevator. Here's five. Okay. 
His door is open. Maybe I shouldn't just barge in. I should probably sneak around. Oh, there he is. Is that him? Am I gonna get like a telephone call? Hi, Paul. It's Hannah. Just calling to see how you are. I hope I didn't give you what I've got. Ugh, oh boy. I feel like crap. Actually, I need to ask you a favor. Could you pick me up some cold medicine at the store? I just got pushed by something. <laughs> something moved. Okay, I just got scared. Something's right here. What am I on? Is, is this his body I'm getting stuck on? Alright, so he's in here somewhere. He's in the bathroom. <laughs> I open the door and he's just sitting on the toilet. Like, hey! Give me some privacy! Ow. My wrist. Well, obviously, we're going upstairs. Everyone's gonna freak out if I don't do this, so I have to. Can't do it. In the bed? <laughs> Line in the bed? Is it gonna be like the grandmother from Red Riding Hood? I'm taking a chair with me. Is he in here? Where are you, dude? Uh, Paul the Ghoul is dead. Presumably another victim of the epidemic sweeping LA. You heard a message from someone named Hannah on his answering machine, asking him to come over to her apartment. Also in the Skyland building, her key, her key code is 1203. Alright, we're gonna find Hannah. Nope, that chair's gone. Can I pick up the tape? Table's coming with us. Damn it! No, shit! Where did it go? Fuck! Where did it go? I wanted to bring that whole table with me. I'm so annoyed right now. I can't, like, bring a couch? Ugh. That is so sad. Fucking chair will do. God damn it! God, come on! <sighs> Why does everything have to disappear? You gonna order McDonald's? Anyone want some? Yeah, give me a number one. Number one, medium, with a Coke and a five, six piece McNugget, whatever you can get me. And, oh, this is not right. Let's just, let's, let's just guess this. Is this her door? Well, I don't think... Maybe this is... I don't know whose room this is. Somebody that's a fan of rock music. Maybe I can take this person's cow... Oh, boy, you got some... Expensive equipment, don't you, buddy? Alright, please tell me that I can take this person's table. Yeah, you got nothing important, but you definitely have a table up here that I can take, right? Mom's best brew. What is this? Photo. I'm just hide in here. That's terrifying. What's the photo? A blurry photo of what looks to be a Nosferatu. Okay. I tell you, the way, the way this game handles doors is just, is just, it's just not, it's just not happy with me. It's not a happy day with me. Oh, this is, I can just go up and down, huh? All right, well, have, have I been here? This is, okay, this is the guy's room. 
This brings us to the bottom here. Let's go up. Don't even need to get the code right, I'm assuming. This is the second floor. Car stereo. I'm just like stealing everybody's stuff. Alright, that's fine. Dirty laundry. Kendo for advanced students. Okay. Just go on in and take everything. And then I can't, I can't take the bed, right? Oh, well. That one guy had the table I could bring with me. That's so sad. That is just sad. back to the stairs or the ladder here this would be floor number three right a table okay pick it up God damn it telephone no why am I trying just to uh, why am I like vandalizing everybody's rooms What kind of sauce should you get? Well, I don't know. Definitely the Wubba Dub 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 Wicked Morty sauce. What's the code here? Don't I know the code? I can't go into the code. This has to be it, right? No. Oh, oh well. I was making a joke that uh, could go. I wasn't actually saying that. Come on. Okay, here's this guy's room. Let's go up again. This is the la this is the top floor. There's no other rooms I can go in. Of course, I can't even open this. Oh, come on. <laughs> Can I reverse donate? So I have to actually... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Strats. Utilize them at some point, guys. Okay, well, I just I just did my three in a MOBA. Oh, look! Email, apartment notes. Apartment notes. How about apartment six? Type list to get available commands. List. Apartment six. Apartment six, Hannah Glazer, the gold mine. Something hot is always going down in here and that something is usually Hannah herself. Mm-hmm. Email. Password required. Hmm. Hack it up. J R at Germa. Email. What? Uh, whatever. I already got it. It's number six. Oh, this guy's actually spying on that girl. Well, that's terrifying. Pizza! Wait, do I want to go this way? Hold on, itchy head. Too many doors. Uh, I guess I am just going to go this way. So she's number six. So can I just go to her front door? 
Just go to six. I guess. What was it? One, two, oh, three? What was it? One, dos, ocho, tres? One, dos, ocho, cinco? What was it? Veinti cinco? Here. Password, one, two, oh, three. Ding dong. Okay, Hannah. I'm here. I'm here to rescue you. And raid your fridge. Safe key. Anything else? What else you got in here? Washing machine, nothing worth looking at. There was something else upstairs. She's home. Paul, is that? Hey, you're not Paul. Who are you? What are you doing in here? No, uh, Paul was blinded by the light. What? <coughs> Who are you? I'm gonna call the police. Uh, let the veils of madness paint you a vision of Paul. Oh, oh I knew it was you. <laughs> I knew you'd come to take care of me. Mm -hmm. Yes, sweet little fly. Tell me of the sickened spider who bit you. Oh, Paul, you say the most beautiful things. You want to know how I got sick? <coughs> how sweet of you to ask. Tell me your tale. <coughs> her name was Jezebel. Jezebel Locke. A lead. I'm usually not too good with names, you know, but hers was so strange. <coughs> I can't seem to get it out of my head. Did you dance with the spider? Where was the web of this black widow? She had a room at the Empire Hotel. I can't remember the number. <coughs> Paul, I really Empire like Hotel. You. You Jezebel. You were so nice to me the other night. <laughs> I don't meet a lot of guys like you. Paul is six feet closer to hell. No, Paul. It's not true. Oh, God. No. <laughs> don't worry. No one will miss your tattered soul. Oh. Wait, why? Why is it? Why, why am I killing these people? I don't understand that. What? I, she just she she died. I didn't do that, right? Otherwise, my humanity would go down, wouldn't it? What's in here? Ooh, whoa! You got two hundred dollars in here. Nice. And I'm gonna really confuse. I'm gonna really confuse the fucking cops that come in here. They're gonna get into the safe and they're gonna be like, what the fuck? Who is this? No, I want this. You can't have that. Okay, let's go. No. Hannah has pointed you in the direction of one Jezebel Lock as a possible link in the Plague Bear chain. She makes her residence at the Empire Arms Hotel. Out and down. This, no, this is a faster way to get down. You guys have already seen me do it. Going too fast. Yes, I am. Exit. Exit. Empire Hotel. Can I stop streaming so you can go to bed? I, I actually will be stopping streaming after this quest chain. So, after this, after I kill this next plague bear, we are going to be done for tonight. There's the Empire Arms Hotel. Let's go find Jezebel. Uh, 
Uh, can I manipulate you into telling yes. me what I want to know? May I help you? I seek Queen Jezebel. Yes. Miss Locke is one of our more, um, popular guests. Why do you ask? I need the key to her kingdom. I can't do that. It's against hotel policy. You sure? I am the key master, and you will make me a key. I see. Well, in that case, perhaps I can make an exception. Malkavian sure is. Seat. Have a nice evening. Malkavian seems like it's actually the best thing to play. Can anybody else do that? You know what I mean? I feel like nobody else can do that. So what, what, what room is she in? A uh, key ring. Your key ring contains Jezebel Locke's key. Well, can... Which room is she in? What room is she... There's a lot of rooms here. What are you... You're speaking smoke inside? What? Excuse Was me. Was there something else? Uh, what is what is her room number? Oh lord, I don't I don't know what the hell. What, I have no idea. I have to like have to investigate. There's got to be some computer or something, right? Don't touch me. Right? Hey, no, I beg your pardon. Come on, I want to dance. I want to dance on stage. How come I not? I want to dance. Can I sing? Oh, no, I just took the mic. I'm like the asshole that goes on stage. Give me the mic. I'm going to ruin the show. These speakers, too. Why can't I dance? That's bullshit. I'm not allowed to dance. Whoa, you can actually swing here. <laughs> violation! Violation! You are in contempt of court! Let me bite this motherfucker! This guy has a lot of blood. And thank you for that. Now let's go real quick over here. Use this. No, I want to use the gun. Use. There you go. Okay, so let's actually play the thing we were just going to do. Someone is still dancing. <laughs> Somebody was still dancing. <laughs> That's unbelievable. Oh, <laughs> uh, where is she? I don't know. I don't want to like have to talk to other people. Yeah, I came here to party. I don't give a shit. Okay, computer, microwave. That's not a that's a fucking microwave, not a computer. Coffee? Coffee. Nothing here. Can I bring my please let me like bring the microwave out there and fucking throw it in somebody's face. Hey, look a computer. And a card catalog. Automated systems access. Jewel just Jezebel Locke's key came out. Okay. Here we go. Guest logs. Oh, sweets. Sweets. The password is available. Hack it. I'm gonna go crazy, aren't I? Skill too low. Fucking goddamn it. Well, I have everything I need.
Look, it's alright. Some I, it's, I'm cheating. Somebody in chat just told me what it was. Like, whatever. I would have figured it out. I would have figured it out. It would have taken me a minute, but I would have actually I would have figured it out soon. Ballroom. Yeah, only one door opens, so it's this one. I need blood. There's room four. Use the key card or check what's in here. Nothing. I used a key. Oh, so yeah. Who do we have here? Are you a believer, little morsel? Have you come for the kind of enlightenment only Jezebel can give? Something's going on with her cheeks. Look at that. Look at her cheek. Her cheek is disconnecting from her face. She's going to be the plague bearer. She's going to rip off her human skin. It's going to be a monster under there. Queen. Ah, yes. I am Jezebel. Jezebel Locke. You are Malkavian, are you not? Speaking in twisted riddles, your eyes dancing with visions they don't understand. You to dance? Won't you yes. you dance with Jezebel, little morsel? I'd rather pierce my tongue with barbed wire. You are a dangerous dark beauty without compare. Oh, come on now. Don't deny yourself the pleasure of Jezebel's talents. Just a few more steps and we can be enveloped by the sweet darkness. Become slaves to the desires of our wasted flesh. Mm -hmm. There is a strange seduction in your viral reproduction. Oh, you cannot escape me, little morsel. One way or another, you and I will intertwine our beings on the way into the Ninth Circle. That's, uh, and I will send you forth. Just jumping right into marriage. The sweet sickness I carry. Can I finally join your shadow circle? Don't you stick to the don't you stick to the paid seductresses? Dark is my soul, but darker your dreams in hell. Die! Did she die? Um. Don't move. Just stay right there for a minute. Die. What happened to her head? Where's what happened to her head? Where's her head? I told you something was weird. Why am I using the shotgun? No, no, god damn it. I'm using the shotgun for no reason because I wanted to see her fly around. Can I take her into the hall? Alright, let's take this into the hallway. Ow, shit. Okay, come on. Follow me over this way. Nice and easy. Alright, just don't mind the guests. Okay, call the elevator. Let's get her down here. Come on. Get in. Fuck you! Oh no, we have to fucking watch this again. <sighs> this time, take, take, put, give me the knife. I have melee skill. Oh yeah. Are you the wicked queen? Queen. Yes, you are. You're dangerous. Oh, come on now. There's dangerous, there's oh, strange eek. shit going on here. Dark as your soul. Die! Here we go. Come on out. I'm taking her in the elevator. You better fucking believe she's coming with me in the elevator. Hey. Oh shit, no! What? No, 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 no. It loads? I fucked it up already. No, that didn't block. 
I have to reload this. I'm trying to like do like a fucking like stupid bit and it screwed everything up. Now she dies. Now she dies without a single issue. I'm not gonna get hit one time. Come on. Let's do that again. Come on out. Hey, you hey. <laughs> I'm back against the wall. Come on, you bitch! Come and get me! What? No, that's bullshit. You guys know that. That was not fair. <laughs> reload! Reload the gun! Reload the gun! Ooh, no hit run. Here we go! Didn't get hit once. <laughs> Alright, I gotta investigate her room. Ooh, you got a chest here. Brotherhood flyer? Is this on the table here? ABC always be closing. And... One of the most awful, terribly designed bathtub jacuzzis I've ever seen. How are you supposed to sit in this? Who is this made for? It's like somebody went into Maya and just smeared their hand around. Nobody actually can fit in there. Second toilet? Well, that's not a- okay, I thought this, I thought this was a, a double toilet, no. To love crafty and bath. Alright, that's it. Turn it in. If you killed a second plague bear and found a flyer with a strange symbol on it, you should go talk to Damsel about this. Yes, I will. That knife is the same knife. Down we go. Open. Got some more info. Hey, thanks. Is there something else? Yeah, I'm no longer needed here. Didn't even see. I, I was so quick. That's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about Mars. Mars reflexes and Mars gaming skills. I was so quick and so precise that guy didn't even fucking see me. I'm not gonna do it again, just in case you missed it. Oh Jesus Christ! What's happening? <laughs> no, what? Why am I doing this? Ah! No! Oh no! Oh no! I lost humanity. Uh. Damn it. Who's playing the piano? <laughs> I don't think so, buddy. I don't know. I, I think I'm like in trouble right now. <laughs> I think I'm gonna. <laughs> I can't reload it. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna do obfusc I'm gonna obfuscate right when I open the door. So they're gonna be right here, invisible. Yeah, they did it. Can't see me.
Okay. I made it. Now I have to drink this guy. When do they. Okay, police are hunting. Call off the search. Eventually, I'm going to drain blood from this security guard. Save it right here. Over there? No, I wish this guy with a shotgun get the fuck out of here. Just move on. Move on with your life. He's not down here. I think I'm going to drink the officer. Yeah, I am. He's probably got tons of good blood. Oh shit, they're giving up. Never mind. Forget it. <coughs> that guy coughed on me and it maybe it got my invisibility was gone. What am I doing? What's wrong with me? What is wrong with my character? This guy was diseased? What did you get for being diseased? And I lost another fucking humanity. What am I doing? Stop it! Look <laughs> how many cops are out here. Oh, I've ruined it all. It's all over from here. So wait, the police aren't hunting me anymore, right? Like, uh, yeah, the, the, no, the police are no longer hunting me. I my health is back. Okay, so I just need to go back to the bar. Everything's gonna be fine. What was that? Am I seeing things or did somebody just what am I seeing right now I'm what wh who is this who's the, is the flash here from fucking DC comics apparently that was really weird Right, where's this bar? Uh, the last round, number nine. I think it's down this way to the right. Can't tell what's a bug and what's an illusion. You Malkovian. I'm so confused. Did I just, I just, I just went back the other direction, didn't I? No, I didn't. Okay, good. All right. Give me my reward that I deserve. Ugh. I did another. Paul is dead. We told him to burn the blood and go to the hospital. Said he thought he'd get over it. Men are stubborn that way. This proves the plague bearer's gotta be found. Yep. Uh, does this paper symbol speak to your mind? I will flush out the pigeon. I wonder something. Uh, what does this yeah, mean? Yeah, I've seen this. Pretty sure I've seen it around here somewhere. One of the buildings, I think. I trust your eyes, memory, and seek it nearby. I wonder something from your mind first. Yeah? The number for a name. The, the jester is the jack in the box. I don't even... Jack? Jack's jack. Okay, I'm gone. Damsel has told you that the symbol on the flyer you found when you killed the second plague bearer is also on one of the buildings in town. Is it not? Ugh, can. Yeah, I see, miss. One Pretty of the sure buildings. I've seen it around here somewhere. One of the buildings, I think. Okay. Where is this thing? Brotherhood fly. So I am enlightened. I'm looking for this. I'm one of the buildings nearby. Looking for it. Where is it?
Buildings nearby. Looking for the skull. Hmm. 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 Skull. In the graffiti here somewhere? Uh. By nearby, does she mean literal nearby, or does she mean somewhere completely not even close to where I am? Inside you the whole time. Can't do anything about this. I can climb here though. Why would I be? All right, I'm just going to somebody's room. I just climbed in the bathroom window. Okay, odd. Oh, let's do stuff here. Get out of the way, please. I can clearly walk forward. Uh, just get up back the same way I came in for crying out loud. This ain't even the right bathroom. What if that was the fucking poster? <laughs> get me out of here. Go. Get me out. This is a long quest chain, huh? Down here, maybe? Instant cash, buy, sell, that's not it. Looking for a poster. Not down like with this alley, huh? I don't think so. Uh huh, well, not over here, guys and girls. Hmm. This can be opened. Just kind of curious what's even in here. Uh, it's just a little, uh, just a little bomb sanctuary. It's all good. Okay, I did not mean to do that. Good thing she had no idea and didn't know what it was. And I went the wrong fucking way. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Let's get back on the main road. Move. Move, you bastard. Alright. Let's get onto Main Street. The main road. That's just dogs. Here we go. Look for the symbol. You guys have to help me because I need help looking. You guys have to. We, 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 look, there's like 2,000 eyes looking in every direction here. Isn't that fascinating? We'll solve the puzzle so quickly. Found it. Okay, so let's go in here. Can't go in here. And hello, Brotherhood. Where's the Brotherhood? There. How are you? What's up, brother? You enlightened? Uh, hallelujah! I see the light. Give him the flyer. I see. Welcome to the Brotherhood. The bishop will see you upstairs. Mm-hmm. All new brothers and sisters must go. You got it. Save it here. Here comes a fight. I'm going to have to fight the ball. I'll make sure I have my blood buff initiated. And 
there is another car stereo. I, where's the guy? I gotta go find the guy to sell. Hey, D did you get summoned? You're going up upstairs to see the bishop. Uh, summoned. You're new to the Brotherhood, huh? Just got enlightened. I, I've been here a few days. <laughs> When the I've been here for three you, stinking days. You'll be summoned, and then you go up these um, these stairs up to the, the t temple. Mm hmm. The 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 bishop. Yeah, I I saw him once. He is beautiful and scary. I uh, I dream about him all the time. He does uh, things to me in first, my right? dreams. He does uh, things I, okay, uh, I don't like to creepy. remember. What of this horrid I temple? I mean, I, I hear things, but but I haven't been summoned. I had a friend snuck up there a few days ago. She said she saw things, bad, bad things. Yeah. Blood. She said, um, b -b blood everywhere. You've had your hands up for a very she, long time. Uh, saw a few of the summoned to try to, uh, oh, to talk to them, but they just, just stared at her with these, um, these woo blank looks, you know? No, one of them, uh, started reaching for her, and no, you she, you've taken she too ran long. away. I'm sorry I asked. Yeah, yeah. I know. The, the, the bishop said, Shed our early to fears. Our, um, Gotta our, shit in the diaper early. and then be done. Rejoice! Soon you shall worship with this warlock. Farewell. Sorry I asked. You got a lot in you, don't you? Alright, get me out of here. Upstairs. I'm ready. All right, where's the bishop? I I can't talk to this guy. Okay, that guy exploded. Why did that guy explode in one hit into a thousand pieces? Is this supposed to be happening right now, or am I not supposed to fight the zombies yet? I'm kind of, I'm a little confused. Ah! There's so many of them! There's a lot of them up here. That was a sick move. This person just got annihilated. Gone. So is that a crit? Right, I gotta be careful here. Ah, I got hit. Unbelievable. Go back to God of War, Jeremy. Experience for doing this? I do like when they instantly explode. There are a lot of you. God damn it. I'm getting stuck on the bodies on the ground. I'm I, oh my goodness gracious. a lot easier to not swing more than once because you get kind of locked in in the direction you're facing it's a little awkward how many of there are you brains they eat my brains okay you're not dead you are now are you yeah maybe 
I'm gonna save it. Oh shit. Put him down, put him down, put him down, put him down. Okay, I got one rat. That's all I care about. This is actually scaring the shit out of me. I don't like the fact that I'm being surrounded. At all. Someone's gonna be in here, aren't they? I don't like this. Just in the walls. Really am a mouse right now. Right, where have we gone? I guess nowhere, really. This is just going back down. Apparently, I could have just snuck around that way, I guess. Can I sneak through here? Yes, I can. This brings me over this way. Continue the trek. No items or anything. I'm sitting there trying to go in every room to look for ammo or... Why would, why would I need... What ammo? I have a knife. I don't need ammo. I know the door is open. Okay, that's the way down. I think that's the only way I can go. So that's the way we're going. Silver ring. Maybe not. Um. Okay. It's, I feel like I'm in a maze. Am I in a maze? I think I found the door. Yeah. Welcome, brother. I see. You have been enlightened. Are you searching for something? <laughs> Do you see the truth? You come to the right place, brother. We got more truth here than we can handle. <laughs> uh -huh. Ah, the disease ridden demagogue. <coughs> uh, disease. Brother, <laughs> you've got to open your mind. One man's disease is another man's sanctity. Here among the Brotherhood of the Ninth Circle, we have shed these earthly labels. Come, partake of our divine communion. Need I speak with you to join this gruesome gathering? They call me Bishop Vic, Shepherd of the Damned, your midnight guide through our last days here on Earth. Do you feel it, brother? The curtain being drawn back at last, drawn back by my hand, by the brotherhood. The brotherhood of the, of the ninth sir. circle of hell. Do your days also end with the Gehenna, Gehenna, Gehenna? Judgment Day, the apocalypse again, brother. You are too indoctrinated into the antiquated beliefs. I'm gonna of do this blood buff world. and go one two three one two three one two three one two three one two three. Powerful and terrible gods. One two three one two three. You talk of disease. Dun, 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 dun. What about the disease that you and I both carry? Our flesh remade I'm into nothing it. more than an abomination, feeding I'm on our brothers it. and sisters like so many cattle. What God watched over me when that demon tore this, into way, my sorry. neck and made me into this monster you see before you? No, brother. There is no God who would tolerate such a thing. And so I have become God, and the diseases I carry to the masses will bring about an end of my own making. <laughs> <laughs> we have all journeyed below into the ninth circle. I too wish to ride your evil wave, O oh, minister of the macabre. Perhaps this is a party best left to plague bearers. I want to join you. The time for words has come and gone, my brother. 
You and I will take those last steps together and we see go. what truth lies so we're gonna instantly behind save the curtain. Let the night fall forever on this cursed earth, and let the this fruits of my atheists. labor bring <laughs> along. Here we go. Instantly, heart. instantly, quick save, so we don't have to do this whole thing again. I'm gonna piss on you. Save. Yeah, he has a gun. Why do I feel like this guy has hacks? This guy is fucking hacking! What? I'm eating somebody. I'm just puking. What was I aiming at? Who's there? Who's there? Hey, who's there? Okay, here we go. Crack house. Mass hysteria. Why am I getting normal male dialogue? Um. Hmm. I think we're gonna have to do gun here. Right? This is a gun. This is a gun. It's time to use the gun. Shoot through the bed. I haven't hit him one time. Zero. All right, this is like the top ten lamest fights you've ever seen. This ain't gonna end well. Blood buff doesn't do anything with that. Uh, okay, what else we got? Shotgun? I don't have any bolts in it. Do I have any bolts in the shotgun? No. Uh, okay, we're gonna have to be very, very good about this. So, what about, um... What about fists? Get this on the fucking top of Twitch TV. Epic win moments. doing? What is happening? What is going on? I'm gonna win! I just beat him! I just beat him! I win! Huh? Oh, don't move! Hmm. 
Why is it loading? The head of the plague grade, thus ending their disease, religion, report back to damsel. Um. Okay. That was, uh. That was, I think that was way too high for me, but I ended up accidentally beating it anyways. I need some blood right now. Like, I need blood so bad that I might just eat somebody in the street. Like you. Or, come on, wait till this person walks by and then this person, I'm gonna eat you. I, I saved the game already. Look. I saved it right when I uh, was done. Okay, get away. I was never here. Still don't understand those hazmat suit people. Uh, look for the bar. Back to nowhere. I did it. I completed the chain. I don't even think I'm even going the right way. Uh, I, I don't believe I went the right way. What happened to Condemned? Uh, I beat it. I completed Condemned. And we moved on to Vampire, The Masquerade, Bloodlines. Nine. I went the complete wrong way. Buy a new weapon. That's true. Where's the where's the guy that sells the weapons here? Behind this truck, right? Get out of my way, man. Fuck out of here. You ever talk to me like that again? <laughs> Eat a stripper. You're not you when you're hungry. <laughs> Uh, let's go. Check it out, check it out. Step right got a lot up. of things to sell. So I've got uh, Sign, seal, a photo, certified. a lockpick. No, I need that stuff. Okay, here we go. Got a Galapagos turtle. This week only. I can't use these. I have car stereos. Company, six. Sign, seal, Take certified. all of them. Check it out, check it out. Step Shotgun. Right up. Okay, what I've got 371. Got a Galapagos turtle. This week only. Here we go. Beautiful. Fire axe. Buy it. Check it out. Check it out. Step right up. And I'm gonna sell the knife. Check it out. Check it out. Step right up. Yeah. See you later. Hey, Perfect. Hey, don't... Let's get that thing equipped. Fire axe yeah, time. Oh, I can't wait to use this. Okay. What about? Say now, brother. See the... Uh, what are you talking about? Well, well, well. Uh... Wait, wait, wait. Sell me your stuff. Yo, I need a hardcore, massively. I'm still standing. Oh, he's giving me a quest. Down. He's giving me a quest. I got a tip that the Chinatown Tong and some local boys are meet down at a nearby parking garage to carry out a business deal. I wanted to check one more thing. I can't tell you what they is exchanging. Right in front of but the let's cop. Let's just yeah. say yeah, the cop is right there. Clan of mine is ready arrest. to drop some Uncle Sam size bucks to acquire what's in briefcase number one. Uh, I am your man. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. Now, if you're the straight Buy out some hard, firepower. Okay. David Duchovny, sick. What else does he have? No, forget the tire iron. Yo, yo, yo. Koala ears. Lazy no, eye hammocks and nothing, right nothing, here. nothing. Hey, nothing. I can sell the wild. ring, but who cares? 38 ammo shotgun oh, shells. This week How much are they? Buy, buy. Hey, hey, don't walk on by. I look like Dion Warwick. How many of these am I buying? I just oh, bought a lot a of them. Galapagos turtle. This week only. Well, I just I bought a, I bought quite a bit. Yo yo yo! I got dinosaur eggs. We don't know what kind. Buy them in hell. Uh, let's put. Let's see. What did I buy? 
Action. Get a lot. Okay, that's enough. Alright, let's go turn this in. Just blowing a shotgun on the street. Hey, guys. Don't mind me. Okay, we gotta get the back to the bar. Almost there. Bang a left here. Buy the eggs. Buy the di- I don't have enough money for a dinosaur egg. I have eight experience points. Melee, I need one more. Or I could do strength. Should I just do strength? Yeah. 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 That's what we're gonna do. Yeah, three humanity. It's a life, life is a living hell right now. Computer. No computer. No computer. I'm doing a min max playthrough? No, I just want to make my melee not terrible. Alright, what is. Is this completed or is there one more thing? Is she the original plague bearer? Find out. Ugh, can. The king of the carrier pigeons and all of his filthy chicks are finally extinct. You killed all of them? You. Huh. So I guess you want me to thank you or something? Damn it. Thanks, mm -hmm. okay? Well, cool for now, but just don't go bragging to everybody about it. Only one EXP. Righteous. Got a new you know, you log? just may have an anarch soul. I'll let you chew on that, Cammy. Some of the boys might have overheard our conversation and gotten the impression I've gone Masquerade soft. Redemption. Somebody in this joint's got a lack of restraint to keep their mouth shut. Maybe see you. Um, okay. Goddamn uh, the pr so that was it. Okay. You guys are all the same. Cool, cool. And, ladies and gentlemen, with that, I'm gonna save it. And that is where I'm going to end the stream tonight. There has been a change of plans for tomorrow. Uh, the PC build stream is going to be on Sunday, not tomorrow. I want to prepare for it. So, no stream tomorrow. It's going to happen on Sunday. And it's probably going to happen not at, like, night. It, it's, it's probably going to happen more towards the day. Although, I don't know. It might depend on when I get done. So you're saying we're playing a game tomorrow? No. It's only fair. It's not fair. It's only been five hours. No, well, it's been five hours. That's usually when I stop. I stop after like three to six. Kind of. So Sunday evening probably. Not like necessarily Sunday night. We'll see. I need a time. Sunday like af Sunday after four, but before nine. <laughs> you know. Sometime at that point. But thank you everybody for sticking around. Uh, for you, those people that were here for so seven, yeah, probably. So for those of you that stuck around for the Vampire Masquerade, thank you. That game is very fun. I did get very angry at the stealth mission. But honestly, like every I, and like I look, I was I a little stupid there. Sure, I was. Everything before and after the stealth mission there, I, 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 I great, loved it. I got a little salty during the stealth mission. That sometimes it happened. But thank you, everybody. Let's go through some bits that I missed from earlier. And we're going to end the stream here. The Elizabeth Dane mission sucks, don't worry. <laughs> as long as, like, that's the general consensus. I never want to be, like, the asshole that's just like, This is stupid, I hate this, I'm a fucking baby. I hate getting that way. It happens sometimes. Not really, not all the time, but sometimes. Hey, if you can't accept me at my thirst, obey your worst. 
Anyways, uh, thank you to uh, Butt Bongo Fiesta. We're starting from uh, earlier tonight, so if, if there's probably going to be some condemned. There's probably going to be some condemned references in here, which, by the way, condemned. Two thumbs up. I can't wait to play the second one. I've never played them before. I always like wanted to. They always looked really interesting back when they were on like 360 and PS3. I didn't play them, so. I'm glad to play these games because they are fantastic. So, Condemned 2 will be in the very near future. We're going to play uh, Hand of Fate 2 on Tuesday. And depending on how many streams that takes us, Condemned 2 will probably start next week on Friday. I'm, I'm assuming. I'm thinking. But if you just if you don't want to stick around for the bits, thank you so much for sticking around. Thank you, everybody. Much love to all the subs and the resubs, of course. And uh, good night. And now we're going to read through the bits. Uh, starting with But Bongo Fiesta 96. Thanks for the $10. That was a long time ago. It just says cheer at 1000. Thanks for the 10 bucks, man. Appreciate it. Uh, thank you, Molotov Bartender, for the bits. Weed Enema. I don't know how that... That's probably not possible, but maybe it is. Uh, thank you to Germa's Nuts. He just says he just says a swear word. It's a bad it's a bad swear. Thanks for the one dollar. Molotov bartender again. Thanks for the twenty five cents. I should play Eve Divine Cybermancy for a stream. It's right up my alley. It's funny you say that because I bought that today. Like I legit purchased that game this afternoon. So you will see an uh, an I not Eve sorry I Divine Cybermancy stream in the future. I'm not sure when, but you will. Uh, AO11, thanks for the $2. I've had multiple streamers and people in chat tell me how creepy your emotes are. Thank you. Well, um, yeah. I, I, don't you know, I have, the, I have the worst emotes on Twitch. And they're going to stay that way. They're never getting replaced. Swazby, thanks for the $1. It's a rat boy. That's what I go by sometimes. Turian7, thanks for the $5. I uh, heard you've been talking shit about COD. 1v1 me, Nuketown, quickscopes only, no last stand. Or I could just never buy another one of those games ever again. I'm not sure what it would take for me to buy another Call of Duty. The last one I think of was Black Ops 2. was the last one I really played. Or maybe... I think... Did I buy Advanced Warfare? Oh, they're all the same game. I have no idea what the last Call of Duty I played was. They're all, the, they're all the same game in my brain. The, here's Call of Duty. This is all I can see. I see myself turning a corner with a submachine gun. And it just being like... Run, run, sprint, sprint, turn this way. Run, keep going. Dun, 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 unlock. Got it. Okay. Uh, oh, you died. Spawn. Uh, that's all I know. I have not, There's nothing else there. There is nothing else there. It's just that, like, corridor submachine gun. Thup, 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 thup. That's all I know. But, anyways, thank you. Uh, but I'm probably not gonna play another one ever again. It's Kronk. Thank you for the $10. I'm sorry for starting the bad Kronk meme. It's because of my name. Thank you for the 10 bucks, Kronk. Before, look, before I turn the stream off. What is the Kronk meme? What is, what is it? Just somebody, just write it in the chat. What, just give me a sentence from the meme encyclopedia. Whatever, what, what is it called? Know your, know your meme? What is it? I'm not going to turn the stream off until somebody tells me. Kronk, wrong lever. Pull the lever. It's not. The Emperor's New Groove. This doesn't mean anything. I'm gonna look it up right now. I'm not going. We're not going anywhere until I figure this out. Kronk. It is Emperor's New Group. This I I knew this. Who this was? The fucking set. Hold on. Kronk me. Wait, is this the thing where the guy's like putting up his hand, going like, "Oh, this is delicious." Okay, here we go. Kronk, pull the lever, Kronk. 
A recent YouTube meme involving a scene from the Emperor's New School where Isma orders Kronk to pull a lever and as a running gag, a vase falls upon his head. The meme typically involves replacing the vase with another object or meme such as Will Smith. Why are you guys saying this now? I don't understand. But why say it now? <laughs> Normie detected? What? What? Just because I don't know what the fucking Kronk meme is? <laughs> Chat, what are you? Old streamer. It was just everyone saying Kronk with movie titles and it got out of hand. <laughs> My fucking face hurts. Please stop this normie stream. Don't, don't call me that. Isn't that like a bad word? Isn't that like that? Don't you not want to be called that? Doesn't mean that, doesn't that mean that you're not like smart enough to understand funny jokes or something. How, what does that mean? Let me look at that. I'm looking that up now, too. Normie. Noun. Informal. An ordinary or conventional person as distinguished from someone who is a member of a particular group or subculture. Uh, I need a guide for geeks struggling to buy presents for normies. The venue had a no blue jeans policy to keep out normies. All right, so it's, uh, what does that mean? You just proved I'm, I just proved I'm one of them. You guys think I'm fucking normal? Guys, I, I, I once dropped a grilled cheese sandwich down, cheese side down on the ground. I picked it, I picked it up and I put the, the top on and I still ate it. Normie? Normal? In the shower, I piss in the shower. And I pee all over my hands and I like use it to wash my hands with the soap. To save water. Normal? I do that. All right, let's move on. We're getting stuck here. Uh, thank you, though. It's Kronk for your for your ten dollars. Uh, thank you also to Buttbong Fiesta again for the five dollars. Terry and Seven again for two bucks. Last time I saw a Living Door was when I beat Persona Three. I, I feel like th those games are great, aren't they? I feel like. I should probably play Persona, but I never have. One of my college roommates was really into it, and it seemed like interesting, but never, uh, never played it myself. Sputnik, thank you for the three dollars. Dor Dorvarine for German Rumble. If I could, I would make it. I swear to God, I would. In fact, I still might. I, I might just be like, who cares? I might just be a guy with a fucking Wolverine costume on and a door on his back. Uh, thank you to Molotov bartender. Sorry, bub. The dwarf arena doesn't apologize. What? Uh, Ryman, thanks for the bits. Night Fang, thanks for the one dollar. When the sun hits that r ridge just right. Is that another Kronk meme? Thank you, Night Fang, again for the one dollar. Knock, thanks for the one dollar. Play Fear, it's also made by Monolith, and Mouse 2 by default is Kick. Yeah, I feel like I'll just... I'm, me and Italics wanted to do Fear 3 co-op, just as like a, hey, like, let's try to, like, fuck with this game. It's like a five hour long game or something. <laughs> Keep sending him crunk memes. No, well, I'm gonna, no, I'm going, I'm going to bed. Okay, let's get this real clear. I'm, I'm going to sleep in like nine minutes. But yeah, Fear will probably be on the menu at some point. 
Uh, Captain Magic, thank you for the $12. Uh, they, he's just calling me a tryhard. And then he says, N.A. Bits. Well, thank you for the $12. Appreciate it, dude. Ivory, thanks for the $1. You have subscribed to Twitch Facts. Did you know that she, she sells she sells by the she and I see I can't even do it anymore. A British scientist who grew to fame by exploring her local beach for fossils, preserving them, and ultimately selling them. While she's been called the mother of archaeology, many cons many constitutes of uh, that word is weird because it's fucked up on Twitch alerts. Just bear with me here. Uh Many constituents often took her credit and is largely remembered by this rhyme. For more Twitch facts, pre I ain't saying it. He wants me to say press 1 for more Twitch facts and then press 0 for less Twitch facts. <laughs> Alright, so it was a real person. They used to collect bugs and seashells and she used to sell them. Uh, so thank you, Sputnik, for the $1 Bud Light or Coors Light. Nah, can I throw them both out the window? If I cannot dump them both out into the sink, then the answer would be Coors Light. Uh, Dark Star, thank you for the $1. Oh boy, can't wait to watch Jeremy. Everything is Dark Souls. <laughs> Give me a break. It's not true. Uh, Connor, thank you, Connor, for the $1. Good choice. Dark Star 7000 again, thank you for the $1. You died again. One of our local italics memes he's a uh, how's he doing he streamed earlier today right what was he playing something weird uh raid oh uh, raid oxen thanks for the five dollars x-men condemned assassin's creed origins dorverine edition that's true that's what we were playing sputnik thanks for the two dollars again german merch when i wish i could tell you i it's just i have no idea uh, I, I want to do it. Uh, there's like three things I want to do. Uh, uh, there's too many things I want to do. I need to like focus on one thing and stop like spreading myself out over the butter like in that Lord of the Rings movie. When Bilbo is like, I'm telling you, I'm like butter spread out of it too much bread. I don't want to get like that. I don't want to get like Bilbo. Uh, thank you, Cat Magic, for the $3 getting called to try hard again. I probably was doing really well in the game. Harvey Birdman, thanks for the 250. What has been your favorite spooky game so far? Are you talking about like in the Halloween week? When I played a bunch of those dumb games? Nosferatu was actually fun and entertaining. And it's interesting enough that it could be like a speedrun game. You have, what, 30 minutes to really complete the whole game? And like an hour and a half before the game is uncompletable or something, right? Uh, probably that. Straight up scariest game I've ever played? I don't know. That's tough. Part of me wants to say Outlast 1. But if it wasn't Outlast 1... I don't know. Maybe one of those random indie games that I played years ago that just throw up awful jump scares in front of you. But it jumps... I don't know. Jump scares... Not as much scary as they are heart rate inducing. And, uh, sticks Renegade, thanks for the $1 stick. Thanks for the $1 stick. If I play Zumbinis, am I going to play the original or the Steam remake? I would try to get the original. Does the Steam remake change very much? Well, I'll have to investigate that, but it'll probably be the original if I can get it to work. Swasby, thanks for the $1. Does Germa like butts? Thinking. Mm, sure, of course I do. Who doesn't like butts? You know, it's like, it's, of course. Of course I do. David the Knights, thanks for the $15. They just say cheer, 1500 thank you. Now we have a clip of Germa is a normie. <laughs> God damn it. But thank you, Dave. David the Knights. For your $15, $1,500 bit donation. Uh, Jowden, thanks for the $1. Take my money that you may never sleep. Steam. 
forever in a perpetual, never dying. Take you take the Cheeto and you eat it. What is this? What's going on here? <laughs> I get so. I get my brain can't comprehend when people start writing out like poetry or or lyrics. I feel like I'm about to. I feel like I'm gonna wily coyote ram into a wall. It's gonna be like I'm gonna read this blah blah blah. Here it goes. Here it goes. Here it goes. And here comes something awful that I just said, like, because it's a stream of words. That's why I'm, I'm, I'm scared. He thinks he has a brain. Uh, judgment gold. You're out. You're out of here forever. Permanent ban. Permanent ban. Gone. Forever. Can, uh, can we have somebody take care of that, please? Can we have one of the, one of the mods can somebody take care of that, please? <laughs> well, if, if you're new, by the way, um, a permanent ban is 10 seconds. Because we, what you don't know is your life, uh, every, every tenth of a quarter of a second of your life is an entire lifetime somewhere else in the Metroidvania in the metroverse, you know? So 10 seconds is is 95,000 eternities in the metroidvania. So <laughs> I've been banned like four times. <laughs> well, quit talking shit. I've been banned four times already. Well, maybe, maybe you should consider that you don't want to be banned four times. I got banned twice today. Yeah. Stop getting banned! What are you guys doing? What are you? What are you writing? I missed the stream. Do it again. <laughs> God. Uh, anyways, thank you to Dietro for the ten bucks. Glad to see you streaming one of my favorite games. Nosferatu for German Rumble, yeah, or Count Chalky Cthulhu? Well, thank you, Dietro. Vampire the Masquerade is a very, very interesting, fun game. I find it to be... It's a, it's a, it's a, li it's a little sloppy. I'm gonna come at you real. I, I, it's a little sloppy. It's rough around the edges. And sometimes you could very clearly move a car through a doorway that somebody else is potentially standing in. And you can't. And just because that there is a dresser drawers space, a moving company could go next to the person and you can't walk by them. It's not that doesn't mean it's a bad game. It's, uh, it's just barely rough around the edges enough where I think it's fun and interesting and funny and cool. But thank you. Uh, Jerma's nuts again. Thanks for the $1. Have a good sleep, Jerma. Have a good day tomorrow and be safe. Uh, Alright. Okay. <laughs> kind of a menacing donation. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, have a good sleep tomorrow, Jeremy. And be safe. Like, oh, uh, okay. I'll, I'll try. Like, what am I doing? Am I like going para? Am I going like d d hang gliding tomorrow? I don't think so. <laughs> Let me check my schedule. But thank you, Jerma's nuts. Uh, childish Brendino, thank you for the five dollars. Uh, these people in chat act like they never used their own piss as body wash before. <laughs> hey, dude, when the when the apocalypse comes. Nobody will be saying shit. Think about that. When running water turns off in like 900 years, what do you? What, what's next? What are you gonna do? You're gonna dig a hole in the ground? You're gonna you're gonna do what Bear Grylls did. You dig a hole in the ground, you pee in it, you cover it, and then like three days later you come back and you start like splashing it in your face. I will not sleep until he looks at today's Garfield comic. Okay. T t okay, I'm gonna type in today's Garfield comic. What is it? Garfield.com slash comic. Okay. 
Okay, let's see. Let's put it, let's put it on here. Let's get this on the uh, on the stream here. Give me just a moment. We'll we'll we'll, we'll go over it together. Okay, here it is. Okay. This is today's Garfield comic. <clears throat> a mouse comes over from the left side of the screen. And he's uh, saying, We're out of cheese! Garfield clearly is sitting in front of a chocolate cake. We have cake and ice cream. But no cheese! Mice. I mean, what, what what more content do you think that he, he can come up with at this point? This guy, how, like, how Okay, remember how we did the McDonald's restaurant thing last night? How many Garfield comics have been written? I love how I just typed in how many and in capital letters in my search bar, how many McDonald's are there in the world? And look, okay, how many ounces in a gallon? How many ounces in a pound? Why did I want to know this? How many days until Christmas? <laughs> okay. How many Garfield comics exist? Here we are, let's see. From the Wikipedia. There are... Since 1978. Uh, let's see, did it say? I don't think it says. It's got to be like 22,000. How many Garfield comics? Come on, nobody has this information? Nobody has this info. It's 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 probably like well my point is is that when you when you make like fifty thousand of this of the same character the same comic strip, you're gonna run out of material and then it just becomes it doesn't matter what you put out. Anyways, uh huh. Thank you to uh, only a few more here. Uh, Ivory, thanks for the one dollar. Uh, thank you for subscribing to our Twitch Facts subscription. Did you know that the letters we have are derived not from the ancient Mesopotamians, but rather interpretations from the Greeks? They named this collection of symbols with the beginning and the end. They called it the alphabet. Press one for more Twitch Facts. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you, Premium Pillow, for the $5. Can you stream a bit more? I'm bored uh, on Sunday. But thank you for the $5 Premium. Monkey Cena, thanks for the $1. Nick Fu, thanks for the $1. Jerma, I know you're in your late 30s, but 38, I hope that I can still be doing what I love to do with as much passion when I'm that age. I hear too many people say it's too late to start when you get older. Cheer 100. Well, Nick, let me tell you, that's a, uh, that is a joke. I'm actually not that old. Uh, I am 32, for real, without any lying or deceit or smoke and mirrors. Uh, you are never too old to do whatever you want to do. Some of like the most successful people in the world didn't even become successful until they were like in their mid-30s. So go look it up. Like Elon Musk was like 60 when he got popular and got made like that car. You know, Jim Davis, for instance, Jim Davis. Uh, didn't, Garfield was not a success, a wild success until he was in his uh, mid-30s. So... You got plenty of time to be having passion. Uh, thank you, Joden, again for the one dollar. Hey, German, great stream. Ha ha ha! Don't eat anything that's already been opened. LOL. Fucking seriously, though. No. <laughs> Why would I do that anyways? You don't need to warn me. I'm not gonna go to the convenience store and go buy like Doritos. The bag is opened, and I'm just gonna eat them. No, I would throw it away. I would go back and complain. And Monkey Cena, thanks for the $5 to wrap it up. 
Much love, guys. That's going to wrap it up. That's going to be it. I will see you guys on Sunday for our PC building stream. Take care, everybody. Sunday, at some point in the evening, we're going to build a computer. It's not going to be a very long stream, but it'll be long enough for us to go, oh, okay. Take care, everybody. See you soon. Good night. Here's Friday's Garfield comic. This is the one from yesterday. What can I say? Fridays bring out the boogie in me. that that was sitting on the desk for like seven straight days and I just fucking ate it. <laughs>